Take the next left onto Washington Crossing Pennington Road. If you've never been on this bridge before, this is the sketchiest bridge ever built. And when I mean sketchy... Continue for three quarters of a mile. I'm at Washington's Crossings, and if you ever cross here and there's cars coming the other direction, you will absolutely crap your pants. There's not enough room for two cars to be on this bridge, but they don't stop traffic in the opposite way. So you are literally pulling your car mirror in so the other car doesn't scratch the paint off the side of your car. I guess we can thank George Washington for this. It's Washington's Crossing, but man, they could have updated this bridge. I mean, we don't have wagons anymore. Thank God a car wasn't coming the other way. I've had a couple times where they've hit my mirror. Here we are. Pretty cool historic area. Star Wars, this is actually the sand people. People that walk right in blankets all day. Maybe I can bargain with them or speak Bachoy on the Dagobah planet. Support the homeless. This is what we came out here for. We're going to our second beach and we're going to sort of an old school secluded private type beach. It's public but nobody really comes back here that often so let's see uh, what we can dig up. The first beach we went to was more of a tourist area and they had just brought in about 10 extra feet of sand so it just was not working out. I left uh, before I got too frustrated. Didn't want to waste too much time but we're going to check out this uh, this new remote location. Uh, stay tuned for the first target. I missed filming this old piece of metal gate. I think it might have been off an old car or something, uh, like a toy car. It's down there. It is down there. We have guys. Aluminum can, treasure coin. All of the above. Hit something on the way down. I think it's a can.
It's out with a hard 1619. More beach trash or more treasure? Let's see. It's in the scoop. Can't tell. Weird. Boy, to set this off. Piece of metal. Yeah, old piece of metal. Like a crack pipe for a pirate. Got a crack pipe for a pirate. Keep going. 23 guys bring you along. That's a probably a coin signal. Some nice erosion on this beef, so stuff's all around. 25. It's going up to a quarter maybe. Rising, folks. Temperatures rising. It's out. Where are you? It's in the scoop. All right, we got a dimmy, as Merrill would say, our good friend, Metal Detecting NY. Not good friend, but I follow his page. Dime. Oh, that's a really, really small piece of metal, copper, whatever it is. Old piece of metal. Guys, we hit on a 1011 here. It's staying 1011, which is usually a really good sign. I hit a lot of jewelry on tens. Also aluminum though. On the downside of things. Something's in there. Target's out, what is it? What is this, guys? I think that's an old, old coin. That's an old coin. Wow. All right, we got our first colonial. It has to be an old, old coin. It's definitely got shape to it. Man, I wish I could read. Guys, that's an old, old coin. What's left of it? Take that home and try to identify it with the microscope, but that's definitely a coin. Was at one point, but it's what le what's left of a coin. Cool. 29.30, hi guys. 
got a high tone. Loud's got to be a coin. Has to be. Sounds like coinage. 30, great signal. It's out. Do a kick, see if we can find her. Really high, 30. It's cranking, it's in the scoop. Yeah guys, we got an old, an oldie but goodie. You can see the year on it. 65, got herself some silver. 1965, guys. Good start. This must be really small. There we go. That's uh, just a screw. Screw that. Got a loud 28 here, guys. Let's dig it, see what we got. Beautiful beach. Anything's possible here. Nobody digs this beach, I'll tell you that right now. A lot of coinage today. Pretty cool targets so far. out big chunk of something Oh really? Yeah, I didn't see. I walked all the way down there, and I didn't see it. So maybe it washed away. Well, that's what I'm wondering. Yeah. Because it was like I kind of think in front of that house was about where it was. I gotcha. So if you're interested, um, if I can interrupt you. <laughs> sure. Be careful with the hole I dug. So I don't know if you can see it. Oh yeah, that definitely looks like it. Right? Because to me that looked like an eye socket. I think that's the tail back there. I gotcha. Yeah, it probably yeah. was a dead seal. Maybe then, it washed away or somebody cleaned it up. Yeah, for scale, I had my dipper beside, you know, the head. I gotcha. Yeah. Probably. It's wild. Yeah, we came down in, I'm trying to think, February and went on one of those boat rides where they take you out. I gotcha. Yeah, that was pretty fun. Nice. But I never expected to see a seal here. Yeah, there's a bunch of them out here now. They came, I think, last summer or last last year or two years ago during the hurricane, and now there's hundreds of them. So they started breeding off here. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. Keep my eye out for the live. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Weird copper. Sounds like a coin. 22.24, probably a penny. Come on, penny. out. Loud. All this place. Relic Beach. I mean, a lot of relics found today. A lot of coins too. 
It's a little gnarly piece of copper. Take that off the beach. out there know what this is let me know I think it slid on a slider or something take it got a 31 guys and a couple dogs Some old stuff. Yeah, so far so good. Yeah, thanks. An 18 a pie, guys. Guys, today's visual roundup, I'll show you a few items I, I got today. Uh, modern washer, a couple of really old quarters. This one's from the 60s. Silver quarter, pretty cool. Um, an old brass, I guess it's brass or copper button. It looks like it has some age to it for sure. Uh, this piece of, I'm not sure what it is. It almost looked like it held a gun barrel at one point, but um, definitely like hand hammered. That's an old piece of, uh, I think it's lead. I'm not, not sure, maybe pewter, something of that nature. Anyway, you get the point. Weird copper pipe, maybe off an old boat. A uh, bunch of clad pennies. This was really cool. Um, by the thickness of it and the way it was sort of hammered out, I think this is an old coin, to be honest with you. Not completely positive. I'll have to look at it with my microscope. But yeah, it has a, like a designer pattern on it. But it looks really, really old. So I'm hoping that to be an old coin. I'll update you when I get it on the microscope. This was the coolest thing I found today. Uh, it was an old, I guess it's made out of brass. It looks almost like a military pin. If anybody out there knows what this is about, let me know. But it's a, uh, it's definitely an acorn on a leaf. And like I said, that's definitely got some age to it. It's got some old folded uh, brass. Uh, looks like clips to put it on, maybe a jacket or something of that nature, but pretty darn cool. Some washers. Like I said, a bunch of weird copper. A couple of bullet primers. Uh, some junk. 
and that's about it. But I think the finds of the day were uh, probably this old copper guy here, the acorn. Thanks for watching. This is Midnight Coil. If you enjoyed our hunt today, please uh, follow us, subscribe, like, all that good stuff. It definitely helps our channel. And we'll see you on the next hunt. A hammered coin. It's crazy finding something like that in Delaware. It's a pilgrim brooch. Brass or copper, really old.